Many patients with heart failure and a reduced left ventricular ejection fraction have iron deficiency, yet oral iron supplementation does not improve their exercise capacity. Intravenous ferric carboxymaltose improves quality of life and functional capacity for these patients, but clinical outcomes have been unclear. In this randomized double-blind multinational trial, 3,065 patients with heart failure, a left ventricular ejection fraction of 40% or less, and iron deficiency were assigned to receive two infusions seven days apart of either a weight-based dose of ferric carboxymaltose or placebo. Patients were treated every six months on the basis of hemoglobin and iron indexes. The primary outcome, a hierarchical composite of death at 12 months, heart failure hospitalization at 12 months, and change in the six-minute walk distance from baseline to six months, was not different between the treatment groups. The main secondary outcome, cardiovascular death or first heart failure hospitalization, did not differ between groups. All-cause mortality was similar in the ferric carboxymaltose and placebo groups, as were rates of serious adverse events during the treatment period. Among five hypersensitivity events in the ferric carboxymaltose group, three were considered treatment-related, and one was severe. All patients recovered. The authors conclude that among ambulatory patients with heart failure, a reduced ejection fraction, and iron deficiency, a hierarchical composite outcome of death, heart failure hospitalization, and six-minute walk distance did not differ after intravenous ferric carboxymaltose treatment as compared with placebo. Full trial results are available at NEJM.org.